Hello friends, welcome to Technique. This is Normal here, and in this video, we're gonna do a quick speed test comparison of the new Samsung Galaxy M42 5G with the Poco X3 Pro. So these are two uh, devices in the mid-range category with really good hardware. We have the Snapdragon uh, 750G on the Samsung Galaxy M42 5G, while we have the Snapdragon 860 Octa-Core processor on the Poco X3 Pro. So let's just uh, quickly have a look at the Antutu benchmark score for these two devices. So here you can see that uh, this is uh, uh, 4,91,000 uh, on the POCO X3 Pro with the Qualcomm Snapdragon 860 chipset while it's uh, uh, the uh, 3,62,921 like on the uh, Snapdragon 750G. You can see that uh, the GPU score is where uh, the POCO X3 Pro uh, takes the leap. Now that's the uh, Android 2 benchmark score. Now next uh, let's uh, uh, clear off all the background apps. So there you go and let's uh, check the network connection so both are connected to the same wi-fi network and both are in airplane mode so we're gonna do a quick speed test comparison of these 16 apps and also the memory management so once again uh, we have cleared off all the apps from the background so before getting started we'll just uh, check the software so here you can see that about phone uh, so we have a uh, snapdragon uh, 750g with uh, uh, the software version android 11 and one ui 3.1 here we have android 11 and uh, uh, MIUI for POCO 12.0.4 we have 8 gigabyte RAM and uh, uh, in fact uh, this is uh, again 8 gigabyte RAM with uh, Snapdragon 860 while we have 6 gigabyte RAM with Snapdragon 750G so let's just uh, clear off all the background apps once again so there you go we have uh, cleared off all the apps so we'll be uh, testing uh, the 16 apps and then uh, we'll see the memory management so first app uh, in this list would be asphalt 9 so let's see which is able to load asphalt 9 faster So you can see that the POCO X3 Pro uh, loaded the game faster, slightly faster. Next uh, would be uh, Temple Run. So here again you can see that uh, POCO X3 Pro uh, loaded the game faster. So which is pretty obvious because uh, it has a more powerful chip. Next is a Play Store. Almost same time. Chrome Browser. Uh, here POCO was uh, a bit faster. Facebook. Here, uh, in fact, it was better on uh, the Samsung. Twitter, Poco is faster. Instagram, again, Poco is slightly faster. Ghana, here, Samsung is faster. Amazon, Poco is faster. Flipkart, Samsung is faster. File Manager, Samsung is faster, settings, again Samsung is faster, YouTube, almost same time probably, Gmail, here Poco is slightly faster, camera, again almost same time and finally maps. Poco is faster. So what you could see is uh, Poco is definitely faster when it comes to games and a few of the application. But again, uh, some of the system apps and uh, a few other apps were also faster on the Galaxy M42 5G. Now the optimization on the Samsung Galaxy M42 5G is definitely good. But when it comes to games and outright performance, the Poco X3 Pro definitely has the lead here. Now next uh, is the memory management. Now this is very important. Uh, let's see which is able to load the apps. Uh, I mean, in the, uh, from the memory and which reloads them. So maps is available. Camera. Gmail is available. YouTube is available. Settings is available. Files. Flipkart. Amazon. Ghana. Ghana is reloaded on the POCO X3 Pro. Instagram is again reloaded. So here you can see that um, Twitter is again reloaded. Facebook is once again reloaded on the POCO X3 Pro. Chrome browser is available on both the phones. Play Store is available. 
So here you can see that uh, Temple Run is available on uh, the Samsung Galaxy M42 while it has been reloaded. And finally Asphalt 9. So Asphalt 9 has been reloaded on both the devices. Uh, here both uh, Samsung Galaxy M42 5G as well as the Poco X3 Pro reloaded the uh, graphic rich Asphalt 9. So what you could see is the memory management is definitely better on the Samsung Galaxy M42 5G. Just one app was reloaded while all the other apps were available in the memory. While the memory management of the MIUI on budget devices or mid-range devices has never been so great. And here also you can see that it reloads uh, a lot of apps in the memory. So memory management is not a great strength of uh, MIUI on the Poco X3 Pro. So that is a quick uh, speed test comparison of the Samsung Galaxy M42 5G with the Poco X3 Pro. So outright performance is definitely better on the Poco X3 Pro. But it, when it comes to memory management and software optimization, probably the Samsung Galaxy M42 5G has the edge here. So that's the speed test comparison. Hope you enjoyed watching this video. Do hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button for more videos. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in our next video. Have a great day.